We're here today doing this uh, street food conference because there's, there's something really interesting going on. Uh, it's street food movement going on around the world. There's been a street food revolution in the US and there's one going on in the UK. And, and this would be really interesting if we raised the question of Nordic street food and, and brought uh, the Nordic countries together for a conference to discuss this topic. Well, what is it and where are we and how can we you know, join the wagon? First day we started at Salt Important Canteen and, and we had a, a wonderful lunch kicking off the, the conference and also uh, we had a street food cart from uh, Bonapsiotto to kind of set the mode. And then we worked uh, our way into the keynote speak and we had invited Richard Johnson who is a, a British journalist who's also written a book about the street food revolution. Street food in Scandinavia has such a rosy future but with the the, the Nordic larder and the Nordic attitude to food, the Nordic love of ingredients. I mean, you, you can produce some really exciting things here. That I think Nordic street food has, it has the, the sky's the limit. Then we had invited Timo from Restaurant Day in Finland, and he, he talked about the exciting uh, project Restaurant Day, you know, moving the crowd in the street, people cooking, you know, outside restaurants four times a year. Later on, we had a speech from uh, Barnard, and Barnard, he's actually a front runner when it comes to street food. He's been working in street food for 15 years, and his take on it and, and telling us his story was really uplifting for the whole conference, I think. And later on we moved to Mink and uh, there we had a silver spoon lecturing us about underground dining and guerrilla dining. Uh, and she also led us into a workshop and then went into this wonderful dinner that Silver Spoon arranged with a, a Nordic take on international street food. The workshop tonight is an extension of the talk that we just had about Silver Spoon. So we have four groups and each group will move from station to station, 15 minutes per station, and they'll go over anything from food and drink to communications, to the visual identity of an event, to you know, something that many people also forget, the financial aspect. How do, how do we make sure we make money or not lose money? 